Hi, my name is Caitlin Keese. Um, I am applying for the master's program uh, for elementary education at K-State. Um, I am interested in this program because um, I have been working on my education degree, degree for the past uh, almost 10 years. Um, I started in 2013. Um, I got an interest for education um, with all of my work with um, in child care. Um, it's something that always came up on my job um, surveys uh, and piqued my interest because I knew I wanted to work with kids. Um, I've always enjoyed working with kids. Um, I started babysitting at the age of 12 or 13 and then uh, progressed on to church nursery and uh, working with kids that way. I nannied, um, I have worked at a daycare, uh, did that for about a year and a half, really enjoyed that. Um, my experience in the school system though is with being a para. Um, I was a para in 2015. Um, I worked with a little boy with special needs um, he was, when I got him, he was running away from people, um, he would not listen, he would throw himself on the floor, um, and throw fits in the middle of the hallway, um, he would disrupt class, um, his regular education class, that is, um, and I got him and, um, was able to make a connection with him, a personal connection with him enough to where, um, I could get him to do things that other people couldn't, um, and was able to uh, help him learn things and be, be able to function in the educational system in a way that he couldn't before um, he had me as a para. Um, <clears throat> I got to see him improve over the summer from his first grade to his second grade year. Um, I got to see a kid who would run down the hall, walk down the hall. I got to see a kid that was um, able to sit in his regular ed classroom and participate and be a part of what everybody else was doing. Um, and that was amazing. Um, that was what I think confirmed for me that education is where I wanted to be and I wanted to be in the public school system. Um, I went on from that, me and my husband moved to Garden City, Kansas, um, and I took about a six month break and then decided that I needed to be around kids again and I missed it. So I applied for a job as an after school program director. I got that job, did it for three years, absolutely loved it. Um, I had grades uh, five through K. I actually ended up with a couple pre Kers um, along the way too. Um, it was amazing. I loved it. I wrote lesson plans for it, planned programs, planned outings. Um, we did, I hired people, I was in charge of training them, um, and managing schedules, um, absolutely adored the job, um, did it for three years, and then my husband got a job where he was no longer able to watch my kids for me, so I, um, I quit. Um, I finished up my year, my schooling, I was going to school during most of this, um, finishing up my bachelor's degree, uh, so I, uh, finished up my bachelor's degree. I had like one class left and I applied to be a substitute teacher. My plan was kind of to work as I wanted to um, and be with my kids as much as possible, but I was presented with an opportunity to do a long term um, and we were in need of the money, so I accepted the job. Um, it was for a kindergarten class. Um, the week before spring break is when I started and I worked with them until the end of the year and further just confirmed that that's where I wanted to be and what I wanted to be doing. Um, I got asked to come back this year, so I'll be long-term sub long subbing at the same school, hopefully under contract if I get accepted into the program. I'm really, really hoping that that happens. Um, anyways, I am, I know I will be a successful teacher because I already have been one. Um, my students, uh, had improvement from when um, they had been tested right before I got there and then they had improvement um, between in that semester that I taught them. Um, they also uh, saw, I mean, they saw enough uh, quality in me that they decided that they wanted me to come back for uh, another year. So um, I'm going to be successful because I already have been. But uh, thank you for listening to me talk and I hope to be admitted to your program.